company here, Life and Fitness, wanted to go quickly over the single leg deadlift. Single leg deadlift is not much different from a regular deadlift, is in the sense that you are still hinging. First and foremost, you're loading your butt, you're loading your hips, and not going to your lower back. So if you were to look at my hinge right here, I'm loaded back, nice flat back, uh, bracing my abs, feeling my glutes, and basically pushing the floor away as I come and stand back up. So we switch it over to one leg, load the hips, stick my butt back, watch my eyesight, bracing, and all the way up, back down. If you're finding that balance is a little bit of an issue for that, and then your form starts to go, you can always, one, switch to the kickstand deadlift like we did before, or add a dowel rod. Um, you can even hold on to a ledge, a wall, just a little tap to help out with that. But basically, that's going to go in the opposite hand from the hand that's grabbing the bell. And you're going to use that just as a little bit extra help, a bounce, stand back up, all roll supply, and sit back down. A couple things that you want to look for when you're doing your single leg deadlift. Like I said, is you're still hinging, so you don't want to lock that leg out. Don't want to look like a flamingo. And you want to keep the shoulders and hips square to the ground. So if you were to watch a hinge at this angle, I'm going to sit my butt back. My shoulders are square to the ground. My hips are pretty much square to the ground. What changes and what we tend to see as coaches is you get a little bit of balance issues. You forget to either one, you lock the leg out, forget to hinge, or you start to get a little bit more depth by going into your back and switching this way. So see how my toes pointing out? I want it to turn and point down towards the ground. I want to see those hips square because a lot of times we'll do this. Again, that's going to go to your lower back. I want to keep everything nice, strong, braced as you get down and then back up. Hope that helps. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact us and have